Super, thank you. Welcome back, everyone. This is Robert from Custodian File. Let's just jump in. So what you're looking at here is a picture of uh, February 2020. I went to visit Dan Aykroyd at Sony Pictures and Culver City. Um, I had a sit down with him for about, uh, I don't know, almost like three hours. And I showed him like 200 of my Dragon videos. I gave him the 411 of uh, what was going on with the uh, police, sheriff, fire department, helicopters. He was very interested. Now, some of you might say, why didn't you tell us sooner? Um, you know, I just, uh, I didn't really have a reason until now. I'll show you where I'm going with this. Okay, so uh, a viewer uh, last week was watching the Adam Carolla show and said, hey, uh, Dan Aykroyd was talking about Marina Del Rey. So I pulled up the tape I'll sh and I'll show you a picture of the timeline, the IP. And Mr. Aykroyd was talking about some guy, Marina Del Rey, who's filming UAPs, UFOs, and um, the police, the fire and the sheriff department are complaining that they're being buzzed, obviously. So this was, boy, this really caught my attention. So that's why I'm bringing this up now um, because uh, it's, wow, it's, it took three and a half years uh, to go full circle. But let me show you the interview real quick, just the part where he talks about Marina Del Rey. The other uh, I events that, that you see all around, that the Stingray, there's a guy here uh, taking pictures of him in Marina Del Rey. The, the uh, helicopters are police, sheriff, and uh, fire are all complaining sometimes about how they buzz the helicopters out here at Marina Del Rey. So many different types. <laughs> okay, super. So uh, Mr. Dan is talking about Marina Del Rey. Um, what do you think is going on here? Um, he did tell me three years ago that he was going to take this very serious and he was going to bring it up uh, with the uh, officials. He was just going to go to City Hall and bring it up. And um, I never followed up because three weeks later, COVID was invented. And, you know, that put everything on hold, on pause. Um, and I'm thinking that what I should do is reach back out to him. Um, but nevertheless, apparently from this interview, he, he, he did talk to the police, the sheriff and the fire department. And to my surprise, it looks like they were truthful. Uh, for sure, I would have said um, they would have all denied it. So that's, that's encouraging that the pilots are being truthful. So what do you think here is one in one, two? Are we slowly getting disclosure, ultra slow? Uh, tell me what you think. Share your thoughts here. Remember to like, subscribe, comment. I do want to hear from you. Anyone can record these UAP dragons. Hold your cell phone landscape, zoom in halfway, record for 30 seconds. Please share your videos with me at custodianfile at gmail, custodianfile at gmail. All right, let's go to the next. Super, what do we got here? LAPD, November 10. Today is November 21. Look at this, look at this dragon coming off the ground. There's two of them, two of them zigzagging. Zigzagging, there's the LAPD in the background. Very predictable, very easy to predict. You just wait for the helicopters to fly in, turn on your camera. Uh, they fly with helicopters, these objects, they fly with helicopters or airplanes. You can do the same thing, record helicopters or airplanes, go to the airport. A lot of viewers are doing that now. I'm getting, I'm getting video from all over the world. Uh, this is a, I call these dragons because six years ago I thought they were dragonflies, they're not. And this is slowing down to 12%. Look at the speed these things are moving at 12%. It's phenomenal. I mean, it, it looks like it's traveling at regular speed. Um, there has been, uh, for the last three months, uh, very quiet, uh, almost as if, almost as if a no-fly zone has been issued over Marina Del Rey. Not sure. It seems like the more podcasts I do, the less 
military aircraft over Marina del Rey. Uh, I could tell you as of today, we did have some pretty good activity. Um, and I'm going to show you that video and I think you'll get a kick out of it. Now let's go to the next. Where are you at? Well, what's going on here? You were just here. Gosh. This is the 665. He was just here. He was here yesterday. He was here 10 minutes ago. And now he came back. Oh, beautiful. We got some clear weather recording behind the glass door. So we, there was something there. We might pick up an audio. Maybe that something left an audio. Come on. Come on, dragon, right here. Ground zero. Tag him. Tag him. There it is, right there, right under him, right in front of his camera. Whoa, dude, what the hell are you doing? That was crazy. What are you doing flying like that? Did you see that dragon? Right in front of his camera. Did Tag him, there it is right there, right under him, right in front of his camera. Whoa, dude. Tag him, there it is right there, right under him, right in front of his camera. Whoa, dude. Tag him. There it is right there, right under him, right in front of his camera. Whoa, dude. Tag him. There it is right there, right under him, right in front of his camera. Whoa, dude. Okay, so what do you think here? You just rewatched this a couple of times. This is the LAPD. Look at this. So the LAPD, the same chopper, the 665. He was here yesterday. He came in, no GPS. GPS means uh, his radio transponder was turned off. Came in today, uh, flew away, came back in 10 minutes. This is the third flyby. And look, this is the hot zone right here. This is exactly where they get tagged, right here, consistent. Look at this. He saw the dragon. He was going into a nose dive. He was gonna pull right up on it, right? And look at this, this dragon just, I don't know if this is teasing the pilot, um, but went out of his way to fly right in front of his camera. His camera is located right underneath his seat. So it looks obviously, see, the LAPD has some really good video of these dragons. Come on. Can somebody post those? Can we see those uh, videos? It flew right up to his chopper. What can I say? What do you think, everyone? If, uh, I know there's a lot of information. It's hard to believe. This has been going on for six years. Right here, Marina del Rey, where the Jetty Rocks are, the hot zone. The government flies in, police, sheriff, fire department. They circle the rocks. And when you circle, these things fly by and they buzz you. And you can see how that could be annoying. Um, but in this case, you know, you, you wonder, are uh, they're chasing the dragon, so who's who's being annoyed? It's, it's, it's kind of kind of interesting there. Uh, share your thoughts. Tell me what you think is going on here. I mean, am I leaving something? Am I missing something? Again, some of you are like, these got to be bugs. Well, on April 19, 2023, the Pentagon gave Congress a note, a report, and said these whatever these things are they trigger the x-band spectrum and as you know if you've been watching my channel i have a lot of those x-band videos so what kind of bug can trigger the x-band spectrum look my camera's pointed at the ocean that's it should never go off obviously but it does so share your thoughts tell me what's going on here um i want to hear from uh i want to hear from you Look at this guy. Look at this guy coming in. I thought he was going to land at the beach. Amazing. Phenomenal. You probably never see that again. It's just extremely rare. You'll probably never see that video again. It's just, it's not going to happen. Came what? Came within 50 feet of the ground? Never going to happen. Amazing. I'm looking at it now and I'm shaking my head. Like, he's, he sees it. He sees the dragon. At least he put in 120%. Um, my advice to these pilots, uh, consider the possibility you are not chasing an, 
an Earth drone from an Earth person, that this could be a very paranormal event. All right, super, let's go. To the okay, super, here's the last picture of the day. Uh, this was sent to me on, on Reddit here. Just wanted to, there's, I think this was from the Space Lab, uh, a close-up in far distance. Uh, what do you think we're looking at here? Is this a real, you know what, if this is a real picture, then that's a real UAP. That's a simple way to look at it. If this is a CGI picture, then that's not a real <laughs> UAP. Uh, but I'm gonna give it the benefit of the doubt. Something tells me that this is real, quite real. And these things are all around us. We just don't see them because of the speed they travel at. That's all, it's as simple as that. Bullets are real, but you don't see them because of the speed they travel at. Photons are real, you don't see them. They're small in the speed they travel at. So share your thoughts with me. I appreciate you watching. Until the next video, stay safe. Thank you.